Margot Shaw's 13-year-old son, Andy, has autism. Although she knew there were risks to having a child in her late 30s, she never saw it coming. I don't think autism ever was something I considered. New research finds a mother's risk of having a child with autism gradually increases as she gets older. Mothers who are over the age of 40 are at much higher risk for having a child who develops autism than mothers who are under the age of 25. The study looked at nearly 5 million births in California from 1990 to 1999. Women over 40 were almost 80 percent more likely to have a child with autism than those under age 25. But to keep the numbers in perspective, risk is still very small, about one in 225 births. We don't know how much of it is biological or how much of it is that mothers who delay childbearing tend to be more educated mothers and may be better at getting the right diagnosis for their child. The study also found risk increased with older dads, but only if the mother was under 30. The research shines a light on a very important disease mechanism that we haven't understood before. As egg cells and sperm cells of men and women age, changes are occurring there that affect the social functioning of their offspring. This study is getting attention because it comes just a week after a prestigious medical journal retracted an article linking autism to vaccines. Scientists believe the real cause lies in a combination of factors, including age, environment, and genetics. The age of the mother or the father may be changing the way their genes are turned on or off in their children. Experts say the risks are still relatively small, and the vast majority of babies born to older mothers do not develop autism. Katie? John LaPook, John, thanks very much.